What you guys, I've got another one of those ransomware removal videos here for you. This one's on the French police, as you can see, demanding 100 euros. Now this is fake. If the police wanted to uh, arrest you for something, they'll come around and knock on your door. They wouldn't demand 100 euros for you doing some wrong stuff on the internet. So we're going to show you how to remove this. I want to thank Malwarebytes Forum for the sample. And uh, there's numerous different ways of going about this. Now these run in safe mode and safe mode with command prompt as well and uh, what we're going to do is use some live CD environments to remove it now there's numerous different ones out there I want to try and show you ones that you can use like Windows Unlocker Kaspersky is a real good one and uh, I'm going to show you how to do that in text mode so let's reboot the system okay so we're rebooting here to rescue Kaspersky Rescue CD and I'm just going to click on English okay so you got graphic mode or text mode I'm going to be using text mode in this case let this load in now this is all pretty normal just let that load up these are a free download to use okay so we need to uh, click on A here for the license agreement and it's saying the computer's not shut down properly and the reason for that is because the ransom had to force shut it now this does take a bit of time to load so just be patient okay so now we're at this uh, window here and this is text mode by the way you might not have seen this mode you may have seen the graphics mode just wanted to use this to show you that you can still do things here sometimes graphic mode doesn't work very well now the one we want is Kaspersky Windows Unlocker so you can actually click on this and then it will do some scans and it will try to unlock it now what you're going to find sometimes is sometimes these are successful and sometimes they're not and now as you can see here we can see that the file has now been removed this was the culprit inside the temp folder okay now you may find that as I said sometimes these are successful and sometimes you'll go to boot up and the ransom is still there so just bearing in mind that these are not always uh, the bestest way of doing them sometimes you have to do them manually so what we're going to do here is push uh, continue and I'm going to now reboot the system I'm going to come down to restart I say yes to that. Now you may see this window, and that's because we had to full shut the computer down, so that's pretty normal. I'm going to push enter here, and hopefully that ransom is now removed. Okay, as you can see, we're now at the desktop. What I'm going to do is reinfect it and I'm going to show you how to use MS Dart and do it manually. Okay, so you can remove it manually if you want to. Okay, so we're reinfected again. I just did this reinfection just to show you that you can use uh, programs like MS Dart, which has a Microsoft standalone system sweeper built into it as well. And it's also got some useful tools in there we can use. So let's reboot to that right now. okay so we'll let this load in now bear in mind we have already removed this I'm just going to show you another method just in case um, that uh, Windows unlocker didn't work okay so we're going to say yes to this and I want to say yes to that. It's just going to map the drive letters to the same. Go next. And what we want to do is make sure we've got this highlighted and go next here. And uh, this is the actual system recovery options for MS Dart. And we're going to come down to Microsoft. Uh, Microsoft uh, Diagnostics and Recovery Toolset 
and in here we've got some really useful tools that we can use now as I said you've got a standalone system sweeper bundled in here uh, as well if you wanted to run some scans with that which I know is pretty successful at removing these types of ransoms but we're going to do it the uh, manual way I'm going to explore and this gives us access to our actual uh, computer I'm going to go into the C drive here and then into users and then the, the account that's infected in this case it's a test and go into application data and then local and if you remember it was in the temp folder before and there we have the actual file itself back in there you can see it okay and there's some other stuff here that's related to this okay so what we need to do here is I'm just gonna delete all this stuff in here okay okay so now we've done that we've done the temp folder what I want to do is go to the Windows um, folder so I'm going to go back to the C root directory and then go into Windows here I'm going to come down to system 32 okay so what we want to do here is uh, just pull this open a bit here so you can see the date modified just uh, pull this open so if I go to modified I'm going to come all the way down to the bottom here this is where the files will be that have been recently modified and as you can see there's a load of other stuff inside here as well which is rubbish these are related to that program they were in also the temp folder as you can remember so just going to delete those and I think that's pretty much it what we need to do now is reboot the system we can come out here just going to reboot and restart ok again you will get this message and that's because we had to full shut the PC down let it load in and hopefully that's the end of that ransom and there we have the desktop back so two ways of removing that uh, actual ransom there uh, manual way and also uh, the Windows unlock away either way will work for you just in case one doesn't work you can always do it the manual way okay now you can also use live CDs like Puppy Linux and uh, those types of CDs are very small to download and go in and manually remove it that way as well okay so I hope this has been useful for you my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk if you enjoy these videos please remember guys hit that subscribe button and also show your support by rating and favorite all my videos and I'll be making more videos again in the future so thanks again for watching guys bye for now